Hi everyone, thanks for watching and somebody requested the makeup I was wearing when I was doing the makeup remover haul so I'm really excited because this is the first request I've gotten and it is a simple liner makeup. I think you can wear it for school or work every day. It's really easy and really quick and you don't have to worry about any smearing that will go under your lashes. So let's get started. Okay, so first, like always, we're going to use the Urban Decay Eye Primer. Even though we're not really wearing a lot of eyeshadow, you want to make sure that your mascara is not going to smear at the end of the day. And what I use is a white highlighter powder. This will brighten up the eye area, but I don't recommend this if you're really tanned or dark. So there will be a big color contrast. And I put a little bit under my eyes as well. And after that, I'll curl my lashes. So you want to curl from the base, and then move to the middle, and then curl the tip. You want to make sure the base is curled, because you don't want to curl the base once you have liner on. Sorry, this is taking a little while. After that, Line. I'm using the Makeup Forever Aqua Eyes. This is waterproof. I only tie line the center of my eyes because I feel like if I tie line the ends, it's you can smear the liner more easy. And then I'm going to use the Bobbi Brown Gel Liner. This liner stays on really well and it's also waterproof. The color I'm using is Caviar Ink. It's a very dark brown, so it looks a bit more natural than completely black. And you want to line your entire eyes. This way, your eyes won't look small. Then you can extend a little bit beyond the tear duct so it will enlarge your eyes. You want to make sure that you're lining your lash line and there are no gaps. Let me move the mirror closer to me. You want to make the end a little fatter so it'll make your eye look bigger. And for this, 
liner look I didn't wing it up I just made it flat out you want to make sure that both of your eyes have the same shape of liner otherwise if one is higher than the other it look it looks it'll look a little weird And gel liners are a bit more forgiving than pencil or liquid liners just because if you make a mistake you can smudge it and just blend it into the rest of the line. Let me just lengthen the other side to match this side. And then you're done. I think it takes a bit more practice. Once you get the hang of it, you could do this in five minutes because you'll know the shape of your eyes. Then just apply mascara. So you apply it to the roots first to stabilize the curls. Because I'm Asian, so I don't have naturally curled lashes. So you want to just curl the base and wait a little bit and then apply more mascara to the rest that way it won't collapse and you would just have to curl your lashes again oh and I'm using the Coffre Dior DA mascara this one has a really cool brush this side you apply mascara to the base to volumize and this I lengthened and then the tip has a groove I don't know if you can see it there's a groove at the tip and you could use that to um, put mascara for the end of the eyes like right here in case the big brush can't reach it oh and it's also waterproof it's very similar to the Shiseido MM lash expander So I like to put two coats. If I have time, I'll try to put three coats. But make sure you use a comb to brush out your lashes if you see clumps. Otherwise, people are people is gonna stare at you all day. And then I use the Maybelline Lash Discover Lash Discovery to apply one coat to the bottom lash. This is good for the bottom lash because of the really small brush head. So it's, you get to the tight little spaces. I'm not trying to get the dramatic look, so I'm avoiding the very thick lash. And then you're pretty much done. You can apply whatever lip gloss, lip balm, of your choosing and this is the look so thank you guys for watching and I hope this tutorial helped you a little bit and this is my second video that I'm actually talking in so I'm still practicing so hopefully you guys won't mind of me my bad grammars and stuttering and repeating a word so thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later bye